Lesson three, dice differences, prisoners. In this lesson, teachers introduce a fictional prisoner release scenario. Players begin by placing the prisoners anywhere in six cells, marked zero, one, two, three, four, or five. Each turn, two dice are rolled and one prisoner can be released from the cell, which has the same number as the difference between the numbers showing on the top face of the dice. So here we see an example of the game board. Students can use counters to simulate where the prisoners have been placed and they can run the simulation. We recommend that teachers give students the opportunity to play through the game several times before they look at the underlying theory of the game, which has to do with the probability of rolling the various dice differences. Once students have a good understanding of how the game works, it's a good opportunity for teachers to introduce the companion software. The companion software is available for a range of Maths 300 lessons at lessons.maths300.com. In this case, we're looking for the dice differences. And we see that we have several options there. We can simulate a single game, play many games, compare various strategies, or look at the experimental distribution of the dice differences. We can select the number of trials that we want the computer to run for us and click OK. The software allows us to simulate the results of individual trials or to play on fully automatic mode. The simulation allows students to simulate the results of thousands of trials in a very short period of time which allows them to make and test their own conjectures.